Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. Hanging out here with Zach at the Silencer Central booth over here at SHOT Show. You guys know I'm a fan of Silencer Central suppressors. We've got a, quite a few of the Banish series. This brand new, just recently announced with y'all, yep. is the Speed K. Yep. I had the chance to head, take it for a spin with you yeah, on Monday. Day. Something different than any other suppressor that I, when it comes to the sound, yeah. just the impulse yep. of the gun so i'm not going to pretend to know anything or or even understand it but luckily zach yeah. knows all about it so yeah can you give us kind of a spiel on the the speed k and yeah. what's cool about it yeah so for those familiar with banish they know you got the, the light titanium the quiet suppressors this was kind of designed to be more of that low back pressure suppressor specifically for two two three five five six it's awesome on on ar platform gas guns that have a lot of back pressure when you run them suppressed so Instead of their traditional baffle core welded or serviceable suppressor like Banish has, this is going to be the additive manufacturing, the 3D printed design. So you could do some different things internally that you can't do with the regular baffle core suppressor. Still utilizes five baffles in here to still give you the good sound reduction, but the changes we're able to make inside give you the low back pressure. So on an AR platform, you're only going to see a 5.8% increase in peak back pressure. So very low blowback. Wow. And with that still the baffle design, the stepped baffles in here, you're still under 140 at the ear, even on a 10 and a half inch AR like we had at the range on yeah. Monday. So if you're running on a full 16 inch, it's gonna be around 135 and a half. So still gonna be under that 140 number, not all the back pressure. Ink and L is gonna have a little bit heavier weight than titanium, but also has a little deeper tone, so it sounds really good. Um, the pretty, sound of it, I was really impressed yeah. by the sound of it. Yeah. And then the other thing, um, I mean, being at the range on Monday, shooting thousands of rounds, never once did I see a fireball come out the front, so very low flash, wow. maintains a lower operating heat than other suppressors in that 223 world. It has the universal hub mount in the back. Most guys like to direct thread to keep it compact, yep. but you could run that banished taper mount in there like your 30 gold runs on, run them on yep. the same brakes. You could run, if you got somebody else's QD mount you like, be able to put that in there. So a little bit different turn from the, some of the traditional banish suppressors that have been out there but i think an awesome addition to the lineup especially for guys running those shorter barrel ars awesome mm -hmm. appreciate you taking us through that yeah the new speed k from silencer central pretty sweet